east wind. That wind's blowing through here. Normally I access that point, but if I did, I'd, I'd blow this bedding area up. So the plan is to sneak out into this open area by the swamp and use it as a pinch. I just gotta figure out how to get out there. in here, a beaver bog, bog rubs, the only living tree in the entire area, so I'm going to give this one a rip, try to get up in this tree some real quick.
So obviously it's getting dark at this point in the video and I'm basically positioned in my saddle. I've got my bow in the ready position. I'm waiting for these deer to step out into a small opening right in front of me. Um, if they end up stepping out, it's gonna be a near vertical shot, but I'm essentially just waiting uh, for them to move in my direction. And while they're moving in my direction, I'm starting to get a little worried that they're gonna catch my thermal and bust out of there. After sitting in the stand for a little while and listening to them walk around, obviously my thermals did in fact drop and drift right in their direction. Uh, they ended up smelling me, jumped out of there. I waited probably 30 minutes for them to get out of the area so that it didn't blow it up for the rest of the season. Um, I plan on getting in there tomorrow night. Uh, it's a great area, there's a ton of great browns right now and I know that's what the deer are feeding on primarily at this time of year. So. If you liked the video, be sure to like and subscribe. I'm gonna be making more of these all throughout October and November, and I'm excited to get my first deer with a bow, and then hopefully um, I'm planning to track down a monster this year. We just need to get a little bit of snow. So the weather will permit, but thanks for sticking around, and I appreciate everyone watching.